My name is Priya Satish and I'm a design team member at the Crafters Castle blog. The blog is now hosting monthly challenges and it includes not only for card makers, it also includes for mixed media works, scrapbooking, altered art, etc. We have different sponsors and different themes every month, making it more interesting each time. In the description box below, you will find links to challenge blogs, links to the sponsors and also the link to the other design team members. Today is my first post as a design team member and it's a tutorial on mixed media. I'm really excited to share it with you all and hope you like it. The sponsors for this month is MHK Designs and for today's project I have used images from Butterfly Wisdom Digital Stamp Set. It has nice butterfly designs here and three sentiments. I love the sentiments. So let's get started. I'm taking a photo mount board and I have drawn two shapes, one heart and one circle and I'm going to cut it out. Here they are. Next, I'm going to apply a coat of gesso on the shapes. I let it dry. Now I'm taking the modeling paste and two different stencils, one for the round shape, one for the heart shape. And I'm there you go. The first stencil is now almost complete. Uh, now I'm taking the circle and another stencil uh, and I'm applying the modeling paste here too. I'm letting this dry naturally. Now next I'm taking the uh, zig markers and uh, I cut out the butterflies from the MHK designs uh, butterfly stamp set. So I'm just coloring over the butterflies with different colors. Uh, MHK designs are our sponsors for this month and I just really love coloring the butterflies. See how nice the designs are. There you go. All the butterflies I finished. Now next I'm taking Lindy's spray and I'm spraying over the heart and the circle. I didn't want even coloring so I just take the tissue paper and I remove the excess color from both the heart and the circle shapes. Next I take the sentiments which I cut out from the butterfly wisdom stamp set and I am just dabbing the tissue paper which is already wet. The same green color I am just adhering it to the uh, uh, cut out. There you go. Now you can see the shine and the subtle coloring. Now next since I am going to make this to a hanging, uh, I decided to punch holes uh, on both the circle and the heart and attach it with a string and beads.
next i'm taking the corner cutter and cutting the edges of my sentiments to give a nice rounded shape now i attached the butterflies and the sentiments to the uh, base and i used the string and beads to decorate them and to connect them Next I am taking a pearl metallic color black and I am giving black splashes over both my heart and my round base. Finally, using red geranium archival link, I stamped the script uh, stamp all over to give a final effect. There you go. The final wall hanging is ready. And here it is. I hope you all like it. See you next time. Bye. As I mentioned earlier, in the description box below, you will find all the links. Uh, links to the challenge blog, that is Crafters Castle challenge blog. Link to our sponsor, that is MHK Designs. And links to our design team members blogs. Their works are just amazing. Hop on to our Crafters Castle Challenge Blog and do participate in the challenge. Bye!